I don't vote. I don't have TV at my home. I don't have internet. I don't have anything. And I just, I, it's. Wait, you don't have internet at your house? No, I don't have internet or, or television. Hey, before we get started, actually, I was trying to express to him that story about politics that you told me. Yeah. That, that I've told the story 40 times, but I keep bastardizing it. Yeah. Tell Nick the story about your view on the politics and stuff. Well, you know, politics is easy to understand because there's nothing to understand. So I, I, what I try to do is I try to take the amount of people in my life that lie, cheat, and steal, you know, from me in some, sh- wish, you know, some way, shape, or form uh, to a minimum. And what I found is is that... You know, people that rise above what I do, which is, you know, a working man, you're a working man, whatever. And when they get to that level where they're actually at the foundational side of, like, being a politician or whatever, I find that uh, not a lot of it is is, is going to be as, as true as you want it to be. So what I try to do is I just I just don't spend my time worrying about it because it's all just a, it's a fallacy. And in doing so, you just – you find that frustration is just going to fester anger. And and be, you'll be frustrated because there's no truth. I mean, you you know the old story, right? It's like one lie compounds to another lie because that's all you have. You once you start that road. So I just, it doesn't make sense to me. I just stay away from it. And I tell you what, I don't vote. I don't have TV at my home. I don't have internet. I don't have anything. And I just, I it's, it's the best thing for me. You know. So like I said, the, the amount of people that do that, I just keep them out of my life, and I and I flourish. So it's, it's the way I do it. Yeah. Wait, you don't have internet at your house? No, I don't have internet or. or television i understand the tv part but the internet's another level yeah yeah i don't uh, i don't like any i just read that's it oh yeah what do you read sorry no Um, it's good i like i like to encompass a few different things i mean you know uh, he's got me more into the finance stuff like ray dahlia's book right now i'm I'm into that yeah i'm in that book i like that book uh it's raw it's good i like it um right now i'm just all about consciousness man I'm, i'm finding myself um, I found that on a day to day basis, it is so easy not to live because you're not conscious. Right. I mean, I, I went through years in the same, like a salmon, I'm in the same stream going against the current every day. And I found myself fine. I'm successful. We're doing good. I, you know, I have I live a good life. I'm healthy. It's a blessing, but man, I just wasn't living. I mean, just completely. So once you find consciousness and you start to be gracious and the generous present moment, you, you really just start to own things and you know so I'm doing that right now and I found that there's no amount of success that I've made up to this point if, whether you call it success or not it's success to me you know from my background where I'm at now I feel like I'm doing good things um, I could do much better I mean it could be much bigger but I'm, I'm I am where I am right now and I feel like right now I'm just starting to live at 42 and it's just it's unbelievable to get that feeling truly it's 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 an enlightening thing and you, once you own it, and you don't even own it, you'll never own it. But once you start to try to own it, and you focus on owning, ge- you know, the the generous, generous present moment, like right now, because never know what's going to happen, right? Then you start to let everything wither away. Politics, right? What I did five years ago, I tried to do a restaurant deal, or however long that was ago. Who? I'm not a restaurant guy. I was just trying to do things. I mean, I was almost not bored, but bored to be bored. I was trying to be bored, right? And so you start doing that, and, and once you get this, once you start to feel this, you start to own this, and it's just like, um, it's just unbelievable. Uh, yeah. uh-huh.